Shots with your face, Private! Wise guy, A! Hey, two extra duties! It's worth noting, the robot gatekeepers can't be in the service, and therefore their involvement in the ranks of the armed forces is extremely improbable. Looks like some alcohol got spilled over its circuits in the crash. If you try to transfer some of the technological features of this ancient device to modern broken reel-to-reel -reel tape recorders, you might get a working prototype, or an explosion. There's nothing interesting inside, except for the drawer runners. Quite an unusual face, although the gatekeeper's reaction to the chicken has become more clear. A detailed plan of the service module.
decoder. Since that's weird. This looks more like some virtual communication between underdeveloped human beings, but it's even more incoherent and lacks logic. Why would coffins need such information? There's no data on the design of fluorescent lamps. To be more exact, there wasn't any. That's a good door. I bet you can't break it. I told you you could handle it easily. A detailed plan of the transport module. It seems that you've successfully completed the work for this Lasinski by destroying the spacesuits together with the captain's bridge. However, this blueprint can help you create a similar one. Naturally, you remember that my intelligence and charm, along with the entire chest-mounted block, must be transferred to a new space suit for it to function fully, don't you? It seems that the stand for the suit is broken, although it won't be difficult to fix it.
many ways to suffocate in space aside from chewing gum. Multiple electromagnetic anomalies detected. There may be some breakdowns in the work of complex equipment in this area, therefore the Breath Edge Company assumes no responsibility for the behavior and performance of the funerary spacesuit. Although I doubt I may have any problems. Hors. Turbines of this size and design were usually installed in old space stations. I will mark it. I hope they manage to escape through this damn spear hole. This debris clearly doesn't belong to the liner, as it is made with outdated technologies. If you look at the spaceship's debris in the distance, we can assume that the liner didn't just explode, but it initially crashed into an unknown spherical structure in the debris of which we can see now.
You've seen such a lamp somewhere already. I think you could assemble one like this yourself, for some unknown purpose. It would be useful to have a powerful soil analyzer with the function of deep scanning, which is usually used by biologists and treasure hunters.
new suit won't reduce the core's activity, but will increase your radiation resistance, which is equivalent. Almost. Of all the potential of the Cedar spacesuit, you managed to use only its improved material for the lining, but even this is enough to increase your chances of survival. Thank you.